DigiKey presents Factory Tomorrow, a three-part series highlighting the latest innovations in industrial automation across robotics, sensors, and connectivity, and new ways to obtain data, all leading towards changes that enhance and improve manufacturing across all industries. Allowing people in the workforce to correct any issues or fix problems or affect the bottom line by having access to that data and making it available. Future factories are fast, efficient, and sustainable. The future of manufacturing, in my opinion, is very much about data, value out of data, and what we can do out of this. Powered by Weidmuller, Banner Engineering, and Supply Frame. In episode one, we look at how sensors and new forms of data collection are transforming the factory floor of tomorrow. For our first stop, we visit Banner Engineering in Minneapolis, Minnesota, a company producing leading sensor, automation, and collaborative solutions for factories across the globe. Matthew Nagard of Banner Engineering shares with us his vision for future factories that leverage new forms of data for increased visibility and awareness. I think the theme to me and future factories overall is access to data. Relevant access to data that is already available from machines or not available, that's contained inside machines, or finding gaps in intelligence and adding sensors to equipment to get better insights to machine health, to productivity, to current status of you know, one's environment. But overall, all of those, that context of data help make better decisions for factory owners, for process owners, for maintenance people, for everybody up and down the chain. So I think the availability and access to data, um, whether it existing um, or future, is mainly what drives a lot of the innovation happening right now, not only in products, but in people and processes. And that's done through a number of different ways with smart sensors, smart edge devices, cloud infrastructure, but coming together and making sure they all work. That allows customers to trade on machine health at the edge. And they take that data at the edge and they take it into their localized MES solutions or SCADA systems and make decisions based upon that. Basically, where is it most efficient to process the data? What's the best for that job? As part of her role helping customers pinpoint sensor and safety solutions, Dana Holmes describes how automation presents opportunities for enhanced productivity in industrial applications. We do a lot of uh, products that, uh, that definitely give visual cues, whether it be for level detection or product positioning or anything. It's really easy. I think we've all kind of become numb to sounds. So you hear an alarm go off over and over and over and you tend to ignore it. So what we've done is we've made it so a lot of our products um, can integrate directly into our lighting products. Basically they take that sensor data directly to a lighting product and so it can tell you how close you're getting to something or it can tell you my level is getting too high or my level is getting too low and so an operator on the factory floor can just kind of give it a look and go okay I'm good we're still in the green or you know what we've got a red or a yellow something's going on I got to get over there and take care of something. I think factories are going to continue to become more and more automated, um, especially as our devices get smarter and smarter and smarter, and we can convey more information. And we can convey more information that's actually important and timely to an operator or to a factory. What is the bare minimum? What do you actually need to make your plant function at a higher level? And I think that's important versus kind of overspecking or getting too much information. Eric Halverson of DigiKey Electronics explains how the company is utilizing new forms of data to ensure the productivity of their cutting edge warehouse. When I think about future factories, I think about smarter solutions, giving us the ability to be more agile, to be more productive, to be more efficient, and to produce higher quality product. Some of the key trends we see in automation factories of the future are condition-based monitoring, we see new solutions for predictive maintenance, uh, rather than plant managers having to schedule maintenance for a line down situation or motors. We can actually see all the different data points of that particular device, schedule maintenance for it, and get it back online with minimum waste and minimum uh, loss of revenue. So IoT and connectivity play a factor in modern factories through giving the ability to plant managers to monitor and view and control all aspects of the manufacturing process, uh, whether it's uh, advanced robotics or motors, sensors, controllers, 
They can view each aspect and each data point and make corrections as necessary. Next, Dr. Thomas Bierger of Weidmuller joins us from the company's headquarters in Germany to explain the ongoing cultural shift among manufacturers, leading towards accelerated adoption of new technologies. The future of manufacturing, in my opinion, is very much about data, value out of data, and what we can do out of this. So the reason is very simple, because all, all new coming up use cases are very much driven about IIoT, are very much driven about um, an analytics, about uh, artificial intelligence, and all of these things are based off data. And at the end, the value coming out of data. And therefore, we see very much uh, not uh, only sensors that are required for data acquisition, not only processors or communication levels that are required to transmit any data and, and not only analysis uh, that is required to at the very end to make additional value out of these data. We see everything uh, consistently required for these kind of solutions. More and more user-centric um, developed. And that's the clear goal. It needs to be very easy to use these complex uh, technologies at the very end. It brings more efficiency to the, to the process, to manufacturing processes, but also it brings a, a huge impact to a better working environment. Me personally, I'm convinced there's no need to, to fear anything of these new technologies because uh, human being is always in the middle of the uh, considerations. Uh, is always in the middle of, of user experience discussions and therefore I'm convinced it even brings everything to a better world for working forces. As demand for smarter, safer and more efficient manufacturing continues to rise, data is critical for new solutions that provide deeper insights into every aspect of the factory floor. In our next episode, we chronicle the rise of robotics in the manufacturing industry and how new designs collaborate alongside human workers on the factory floor to create new, high-quality job opportunities across Factory Tomorrow.